we're going to focus on small steps that we could take towards detoxing. Now when I use the word detox, I'm not thinking cleanse, I'm thinking more lessening the processed foods this week. Not for weight loss, but for increasing. Increasing our energy levels, increasing our ability to think clearly, basically increasing our ability to get through the days and not be completely exhausted come the end. We're going to start slow and I'm going to ask you to join me today in planning one light, not processed, whole foods, whole grain meals for tomorrow. We're going to set ourselves up for success today by perhaps shopping and getting what we need for this meal tomorrow, searching for fruits, vegetables, especially the leafy green vegetables, complex carbs, those whole grains, basically anything that's not processed white, fake sugar, or alcohol is what we're going to do tomorrow just for our one light detox meal. After tomorrow, take a minute at night or immediately after the meal and jot down how you felt. Did you feel better? Did you feel more energetic and less sleepy? Were you still hungry? Did you feel satiated? Take notes and be honest. Then, try another detox meal this week, tweaking with the changes that you noticed after the first meal. Maybe you needed more food now that you've taken out the processed. Maybe you needed less food. Make the changes that you can see you needed based on your journaling. Now, after that, we're going to make it a goal this week and in the coming weeks to have perhaps one full detox day a week. One day of no processed foods, no alcohol, plenty of water filled with complex carbohydrates, fruits, and vegetables. And you never know, it might become a lifestyle and every single day might become a detox day. Or you might just be like me and focus on having one clean food, no alcohol, detox day every single week.